first thing you want to do is go to that website that I created, uh, Blogspot website, and uh, get the go under uh, Tools and then Free Storage Space link. Click that, and then you're going to log in. Okay, now you need to, uh, you're going to upload your saved mp3 file that you've saved to your desktop. So click the upload icon and then click the add files button. And then just look for your saved mp3 file on your desktop, highlight it, and then click open. And then you're going to click the upload button to the right of the add files button. Okay, it'll have created a link for you, and so you're just going to put your cursor over that name, right-click it, and then copy shortcut. Now you're going to open your HTML kit and paste it in a blank document and just hang on to that. Now go to that uh, link I told you to save, and it's got all the information as far as it a template that you can just use and change when you need to. So copy the first one out and then paste it back into that HTML document somewhere a few spaces below your new link and you're just going to replace the old link with the new link. And then of course you're going to want to change the text so Tyler Hansbrough explains or however you know what it needs to say. Notice that uh, little bracket close bracket A. Anything between that is going to be the part that's highlighted online. And then uh, your how long the segment is. And then you're going to copy that link that you just created. Open your FastFacts box link in Drupal. And then uh, you're going to click the HTML button. Normally in Drupal you're going to click the T icon, but now we're going to go to the HTML button. and then uh, just paste the paste it in there now in this case I just made multiple links just to show you that between each one you're gonna have to separate them out with spaces it's a little different they're not gonna be the BR space they're actually gonna be P as in Paul so uh, you know open bracket P close bracket P after the 42 after the time so that's one space and just copy that after each uh, each one and click update now you notice that the spaces it's two spaced out and it's just a little thing you have to work with meaning go back into it and just get rid of the extra piece so there should be one line devoted just to piece get rid of it delete it out and you can kinda eyeball it as far as you scroll back to the bottom, you click update, and if they look properly spaced out, then you're good to go. If not, you can go back in there and add a P or remove a P or whatever. You need to add a header, so audio, and that's it.